In a major display of protest, the United States Conference of Catholic Bishops is taking a stand against the Trump administration's immigration policies. This comes two days after Attorney General Jeff Sessions announced that most domestic and gang violence victims will no longer qualify for asylum here and follows weeks of controversy over the policy of separating children from their parents. CBS4's Carrie Codd is live in Fort Lauderdale with more. Carrie. Rick, a number of those bishops recently attended or just finished attending a mass here at St. Pius X Church in Fort Lauderdale. They're in town from all over the United States for the Conference of Catholic Bishops. And today, earlier at their spring assembly meeting here in Fort Lauderdale, they did issue a very strongly worded statement calling some of the Trump administration's actions on immigration immoral and said they need to end. More than 300 Catholic bishops from across the United States gathered in Fort Lauderdale Wednesday for their spring assembly. At the meeting, they made a major announcement regarding the Trump administration's immigration policy, specifically regarding a significant limitation on people claiming asylum. At its core, asylum is an instrument to preserve the right to life. The statement said the bishops feel that Attorney General Jeff Sessions' decision to limit asylum seekers from trying to stay in the U.S. will have a chilling effect on women particularly. These vulnerable women will now face return to the extreme dangers of domestic violence in their home country. This decision negates decades of precedents that have provided protection to women fleeing domestic violence. The bishops also said that the administration's policy of separating parents from their children at the U.S.-Mexico border needs to stop. Separating babies from their mothers is not the answer and is immoral. But Kirsten Nielsen, Homeland Security Secretary, said it's a matter of the law. I mean, that's why they're separated, because they're breaking the law. They're coming across the border, and they're breaking the law. In the United States, if you break the law, you go to jail, and you're separated from your family. Thomas Wenske is the Archbishop of Miami. He says the church should urge Catholics to vote for candidates who want fair and humane immigration reform. We have to tell our parishioners to uh, Hold them out and hold them accountable. Wensky says these policies are misguided. We have to make America great, as, uh, as our president says, but we're not going to make America great by making America mean. And one U.S. bishop from Arizona is taking an even stronger stance. He's suggesting that possibly Catholics who take part in separating children from their parents should be stripped of their ability to receive the sacraments and possibly even excommunicated from the church. Live in Fort Lauderdale, Kerry Cott, CBS 4 News.